Okay guys, uh, let's see. In the previous video, we saw that how we can use the basic input settings in the Shopify theme section. Uh, we explored a rich text section uh, in the Shopify theme and now let's see with the basic input settings uh, we also have specialized input settings uh, here is the list of the specialized input settings I will be sharing this uh, link in the description of this video so that you can explore all the uh, specialized input settings uh, by yourself okay for now uh, let's see in the rich text we can see this color scheme uh, this is of a specialized input type uh, we can see color scheme is of specialized input type and uh, let's see how this is being used in our uh, rich text section okay uh, in the settings of uh, our theme uh, in the settings of our section uh, let's see here the color scheme is being used right here okay let's see how uh, it is used in the markup uh, of the section okay here we can see this color scheme is uh, used to create the CSS class and this class will uh, later on uh, apply apply the different color scheme uh, to the section okay now uh, you can explore all these uh, input settings uh, by yourself and we will also uh, use uh, some of these uh, settings uh, while creating our own custom sections further down in the course okay now let's see how uh, the blocks are being uh, rendered in the shopify section as you can see here we can add different blocks uh, to our section okay let's see how this uh, this setting is uh, created in the Shopify section okay in the settings uh, we can see some blocks right here under the setting uh, in the schema we can see we have name tag class and settings and under the settings we ca uh, we can see the blocks uh, a list of blocks we can define uh, the schema of each block right here and each block can have its own settings okay let's see uh, this rich text has a heading block and a caption block and a text block and a button block okay we can see the rich text has four type of blocks and now we can see in the customizer we have caption a text block a rich text block and a button block and each block has all has a unique settings of its own okay now let's see uh, the heading block uh, and its settings you can see uh, the settings uh, it has some basic settings like inline rich text and select select is used to uh, uh, select the heading uh, hierarchy like h1 h2 or hxl and uh, let's see how these blocks are being uh, rendered in the markup of our section okay we can see uh, we are looping through all the section blocks and we are using a switch case in the liquid so when when the block is heading uh, here we are rendering the markup of the heading and uh, we are also getting the uh, settings of the block uh, from this object like block settings and heading settings and similarly uh, we are rendering the caption text and the button and uh, by using these building blocks like the basic input settings and the specialized input settings uh, we can create our custom uh, sections according to the business needs I hope this helps in further down the course uh, we will create our own custom sections uh, that will help to uh, 
gain more knowledge about the uh, sections in the Shopify theme. I hope this helps. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.